are picking up a playpen for our... Not one. Not one. <laughs> but two. Two puppies! It was a little yeah. something like... was to create more vlogs so this is my first one of the year <laughs> and it's an exciting one because uh, Chris and I we are on our way to um, we're heading to Scarsdale New York which is about like a 40 minute drive yeah from where we live we live in, in the city so we are heading over there. We are picking up a playpen. It's not for a baby. <laughs> um, we're picking up a playpen for our... Not one. Not one. <laughs> but two. Two puppies. puppies. We're getting puppies. Um, I know. It's like, <laughs> no, no, no. You know, one wasn't enough. Um, so it was, we're actually adopting them. Um, they're rescue puppies. The mom was rescued from a kill shelter and then some foster parents took her in and she had the puppies there. So um, we, on Wednesday, a few days ago, we actually went and we met the puppies. I fell in love with one, Chris fell in love with another one. Yeah. And we <laughs> honestly, like, we could not, we couldn't choose, we couldn't choose and like, we're like, what the heck? Why not? Like, so we did it. I don't know what we got ourselves into. I don't know if we're going to regret this later on. I don't think we are, but yeah, I, I'm sure we're going to love every single moment. Um, so they were kind of like our, our, our first New Year blessing. Um, and they're just so sweet. Like, I can't wait to just have them home and like show everyone um but they're just oh my gosh melted of course they're puppies so obviously they're gonna be just gorgeous and cute and just cuddly but oh my god they were just so sweet oh just like you just feel, you know you feel the energy so we adopted two and um obviously it's a huge financial you know responsibility so with that being said, we're like, okay, we need to be, you know, savvy, you know, financially savvy and everything. So we are actually, like I said, we're on our way to Scarsdale. We are picking up the playpen. So I went on Facebook Marketplace and I found a lady that was selling a doggy playpen. So when I was looking for them, I fell in love with one by this company. It's gorgeous. It's made out of like clear, um, glass. clear glass type of thing like plexiglass and doesn't really feel like a cage doesn't look like a cage it's really aesthetically pleasing to just have I have like this mask I'm like, new pimple of the new year by the way um, <laughs> just decided to make an appearance in the new year too um, but it's made out of like plexiglass and it doesn't really look like an animal cage so it's really aesthetically pleasing to have like in your apartment and in your house. So we really, really fell in love with that one. It's just super like over budget, especially because we have to consider the fact we're gonna be having two puppies. So um, I went on Facebook Marketplace and I actually found someone that was selling hers for like 70% off of the retail price. Of course it was used, had a little bit of scratches here and there, but honestly, I don't really care. I would rather have like the one that I want and just sacrifice, you know, just it looking, I'm sure it looks fine. And what I really like about this one is that you can decorate it and it looks really cute. I've seen people on Pinterest like decorate it for Christmas. It's, it's literally like a pup, ah! it's literally like a puppy penthouse. So, um, I'm excited to go pick it up. So we're on our way to pick it up. And then we're going to head to, I really need to get a, like, a handle. What is it called? Like a, not a, a handle. Yeah, sorry about the bumps, everyone. But, um, yeah, so after we pick it up, it should be already assembled. If it's not, 
then we are going to show um, you know show us assembling it and then after that we are gonna head to Petco and we're gonna pick up a few things we got a lot of the things on Amazon we're gonna go get their doggy tags um, because the shelter or it's not really it's not a shelter the animal um, adoption agency yeah. they require us to um, to bring the dog tags already so they want to see that they have the dog tags with our address and our phone numbers on it so uh, we're heading to Petco pick that up pick up a couple of other things maybe if I see some like cute toys um, but the playpen is like really what we really really need but I'm excited to show y'all the setup of the new puppies and yeah this new journey that we're about to embark on <laughs> Also, Target is having a 90% off sale. At the time of this recording. <laughs> so you know what that means. <laughs> Where are we going, babe? We going back home. Yay! <laughs> After Target. <laughs> an epic fail but we got <laughs> a couple of things at home goods which never lets me down we picked up the playpen we had to unassemble it so it's in there and now we are heading to petco yep. all right let's go make these doggy tags that we did, right? Yeah. We did the tags. This is one of them. This is the other. We have Rome and Rio. Oh, look at this shine. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> now I thought we were gonna have time to set up the um the playpen, but it's been such a long day. We wasted so much time in Target and we couldn't even find anything and it was so packed. It was it was horrible so i'm like i don't have the patience for this right now so we left and then we went to tj maxx wasted time there because they didn't have anything there either so home goods, home goods we yeah <laughs> home goods is where we scored so it's like we're probably going to make or uh, create the playpen tomorrow we're gonna get some wings right now oh, yeah. <laughs> and that's it call it a day <laughs> okay we are going to start building the clearly loved pets playpen and it's gonna go in this space right over here and <laughs> chris is bringing all this stuff over while i just sit here and relax just kidding <laughs> We cleared this stuff. The room kind of feels cluttered. So this is our bedroom. And the puppies are going to stay here for now. They're going to be in the, in the bedroom with us for now. And then we have plans to just move the playpen in the living room and they'll stay there. But because they're puppies, until they acclimate, um, we're going to just have them with us here. <laughs>
wiping these down. Okay, so we finished uh, setting up the playpen. This is what it looks like. We just cleaned it off because remember it was a used one. And this is how it looks. So it's 24 by 72. So they'll have more than enough space to kind of just like roam around. You can open the door and then you can just step inside. Babe, <laughs> it's towards the middle. <laughs> and then you can walk in. Please stop. Okay. <laughs> and then you can walk. This is really cute. So we're going to keep it in the bedroom for now. Um, our bedroom is not that spacious, but we managed to fit it in here. And then we might be moving it to the living room. But like I said, for now, we're going to just we'll keep it. it yeah, keep it in here. And we're going to... Decorate the playpen a little bit, and by we, it's me, really. And, um, yeah, I first, though, I want to show you guys what I got at Home Goods yesterday. A couple of cute little so things. So, we found this cute wolf mat. It's supposed to be for food, but I think I'm going to use it as, like, a little entrance mat for the playpen. Um, and then this little stuffed toy. Um, I got most of their toys on Amazon because I found like this bundle that came with a bunch. This cute little, um, how do you, what is this? Like a little bin That's or basket for their toys. So I'm still waiting on the ones for Amazon to get here, but this is where their toys are going to go. Then I also found this really good mat. So the material is like... I don't even know how to explain this material, but it's actually going to go inside their playpen just so like the floor isn't so cold for them if they want to like not be in their beds, but it's going to go in their playpens. I'm actually going to put it in right now. And then we found this, um, this food bin. So this is where we're going to store their foods and their treats. Um, and then speaking of treats, we're going to keep their treats in here. Um, and we're going to just like leave it in the kitchen. And then whenever we see them doing something good, then we'll just grab a treat from here. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much what we got from Home Goods. A couple of little essentials. The rest are coming from Amazon, so I'm, I'm going to do like an Amazon haul video on all of the puppy stuff, so stay tuned for that. And then the next video after that is going to be the puppies coming home mm -hmm. and our first night with the puppies. <laughs> so definitely make sure you are subscribed and if you want, come back to see what our journey is going to be like with these two little fur babies. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.